Today I was given the okay after my doctor's checkup to work out a little bit. To uh, do some Carenza after my um, heart attack a week and a half ago. Now, this to me is more than exercise. This is like a deadly ballet. It's dance, it's self-expression. It's the uh, expression of movement of the human body. And there is a saying that is attributed to Filipino knife fighters that says, move or die. And this is true in life. We gotta keep moving, we gotta keep our hearts pumping we gotta keep our blood flowing because sedentary lifestyles lead to death now i don't lead a sedentary lifestyle i have a genetic disposition for heart disease and i haven't been eating as well as i should as a diabetic and pile on a bunch of stress and you get a perfect storm but I haven't been feeling well for a while now that my blood is flowing again I have to be careful because I feel so good I mean I feel really good it's incredible how much more alert I feel how much more alive I feel I'm lucky to be alive. And the thing about this is I'm not adding stress. I'm just gonna express myself from now on. Express who I am. I only do two systems of Filipino martial arts now. I just gotta say, fuck all the political bullshit. Fuck trying to claw my way to the top of some kind of imaginary fucking hierarchy. Fuck all that crap. Sometimes you gotta say fuck it and just express yourself. That's what I'm gonna do. Boondock Eskrima and the Camp 123. That's my only Filipino martial arts style. When I say this, there will be Boondock Balinta Walk. And I will always, to the best of my abil ability, teach Muay Thai under my Ajahn. But I'm not hustling to fit in with some group of um, people who don't even live near me, who I gotta sacrifice to go see. I have to pay a lot of money to test. Fuck that shit. I'm just gonna be me.